Hey guys, we're back with uh, Valhalla. So, played 40 minutes of this before and I liked it. So, I'm going to play it again. The Ballad of a Gay Ghost, 1.2.1.3. It was something else before, right? Does that like change every time you log in? Or log in and start the game again? Use this options? Yeah, okay. Let's go. And load. Okay, alright, we're on day one break. This one didn't get locked up this time, are you? Oh yeah, I have to click in the box. Why jukebox, uh, uh Okay, so these are the songs playing, uh let's just Yeah. We gotta play Welcome to Valhalla, you know that's that's you have to. Umi Neko, of course. Where do I go from here? Uh, will you remember me? March of, a, of a, the White Knight. Neo Avatar. Nighttime Maneuvers. Star Pierces the Dark. Snowfall. Reminiscence. Answer Lies Within. Okay, that looks about the Look at other songs. Okay. Okay then, back in action. Let's go. It's been a couple days for me because I was away for a couple days. Good evening. Good evening, robot. Um, would you mind taking your helmet off? Oh, sorry. It's so comfortable. You should forget I have it on. This better? Uh, yeah, thank you. What can I get you, miss? Master Specialist, Say P. Asagiri of- Oh, that's a big drink name. <laughs> the 765th Division, Valkyrie Corpse, Agri Supers. Wait, it's too long. Just call me Say. Is that Say? C-I? <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. What can I get for you, Say? Let's see. In the mood for a sweet drink. Oh, but not sweet as in cool. Although, cool drink would be nice to a while. Not cool as in great. Especially not as in big. Worry so since I have to get up early for tomorrow and I can't afford a hangover. Part, pardon? Um, sorry, did you get that? Sweet drink. Preferably a cold one that's not too big, right? Yeah, that's it. You can do that. Give me a second. Okay, by flavor, sweet drinks. Something small, sweet, and iced. And no karma drink. Sweet, light, and fruit. It? Bitter, no, no, no. Oh, we have to go by flavor. Can't just and mixed. So that's sweet. Um, is it small? All right, it looks pretty small and icy. And it looks about good. Powdered delta and all the Wait, no. Oh, not at all. Blue fairy. All aged and... Mm -hmm. What does my type mean? Okay. Did we just look at that? Yeah, we did. Moonblast. All my rocks and blunty. And that's... I think that's a big one. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, it is. What is it? Anything above ten or anything at ten? I don't actually... Piano woman? No, let's definitely do So... Small, sweet, and icy. Oh, okay, hold on. Uh. There's, there's one that I found that was at 10, right? Which... Moonblast? Yeah. I guess we'll do this one. I already have one in there. Let's hope this isn't bacon. Rocks and blunt. I assume ice means rocks, right? Let's... And blunt? Wait, blunted? How do we blend? Guys, how do we blend? <laughs> Have we not unlocked that yet? Does blended mean, like, super shake? 
successful. We did it. I'm a genius. Here you are. Ah, yes. This is just what I needed. Thanks. We don't get many white knights as knights. I only remember one other. Event. You said you're from the Valkyrie Force, right? Do you think I should deal with riots and such? Riots? Oh, no, 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 no. We're thinking of the Blitzkrieg Forces. The ones with huge plated suits, right? Yeah, those. No, we're different people. I mean, obviously we are different people. But we don't deal with... That's what a robot would say. But we don't deal with the riots or anything. In fact, you could say we deal with their aftermath. How so? To rescue, heal, and protect. You're the angels who slew those suffering enemy attack. We are the light of hope in the darkness of times. The ones who assist in the victims of crime. We watch, we protect. Uh, what was that? Sorry. Sort of our pledge of allegiance. Oh no, she just made that up. You settle every morning. What he means is that our dues mostly include rescuing civilians, healing the injured, protecting them from uh, stuff. What kind of stuff? Regulars, rapists, car crashes, anything that might happen on their watch. Legend heal. Are you a doctor then? Nah. No money doctors, but I'm not one. More of a paramedic. Treat people so they can arrive safely at a doctor. I'm also kind of a firefighter and then I sometimes rescue people from places. Dang! Pardon my French. That must be a tough job. Sort of. But it's also really rewarding. I mean, you get to meet somebody that isn't glad to see me when I arrive. Must have seen some shocking things. Yeah, this one time when I was saving some people from the top of a collapsing building. Look down, he was blown away by how pretty the city was. Hey! Like a starry sky on earth. Nothing like those dystopian cities, eh? Oh, there's this time we were cleaning up the aftermath of a car crash. Water is pouring out of a hydrant. The lights and scattering pieces of glass. It's all almost dreamlike. But, but not what I meant by shocking sight. Well, but those are sights. They're shocking, right? Well, yeah, but never mind. Wait, did I miss hear you and actually meant size? I mean, sure. Except for the deepest, longest, and most frustrating size of people after everything's done and said and done, but... Look, don't worry, you didn't see it. Guess I was just expecting a different kind of agency. What kind of agency? Don't worry too much about it. Finished your dream. Can I get you anything else? Uh, some of classy, like classy dream. Can you be more specific? Don't make it too big. Does that work? Sorry, I don't come to bars very often. Drinks usually come in a can. No problem, don't worry. Classy drink, right? Let's see what I can find for you. Just serve me like a piano. That, that usually works, right? Oh, oh, oh no, not the classic drinks, the classy drink. And... She said earlier that you didn't want to get that hangover, right? So... Do we still have to keep that in mind? Oh, right, right, right. We have to go back every time. And... Oh, no. And... I guess that works. Eh, but... Eh. Who cares? All the rocks and blended. There we go. Here you are. Yep, this looks like something Stella would do. Who? She's my dearest friend. Now that I don't know how many of these, but she's the one I've known the longest. She likes these kind of drinks, so I wanted to see what's so special about them. And what do you think? I was expecting something strong here. Lucky quite a bit. Say, Miss Bartender. Hey, she's talking to me. What's your name? Huh? You know my name. I want to know yours. Oh, sure. Just call me Jill. Jill. Hmm. Jill. Jill is short for Jillian. No, that's not right. Jillian. J Julianne. Do not call me Julianne, please. Sorry about that. No, please excuse me. I don't want to anger you. Uh, why don't you like being called by your full name? The stupid reason. Don't dwell on. Don't dwell too much on that. Oh, okay. Don't feel bad about angry you though. Why? You look like a nice girl. Oh. Don't like angering nice people. Yuri out. 
Let's go. Does this game have routes? Does this game have multiple endings? It helps somehow. I really like this place. That actually helps. You're the first person to say something nice today. Thanks. Oh yeah, there's uh, that one rich guy who ran the newspaper and the other guy who uh, hired a girl for three years to be his daughter. Right, right. What do you like about her? Smell of dog urine and soap. Well, yeah. <laughs> Mom used to be a veterinarian. I used to get to her cl clinic after school, so the smell takes me back. It makes me feel comfy and nostalgic. <laughs> what made you become a white knight instead of a veterinarian or anything else? Well, it's never good a, a good student, so studying medicine or any of any kind was out of the question. That aside, it's most because of something that happened while I was a kid. A white knight attacked my friend and was coming for me when this other white knight saved us. I don't remember what happened next. I just woke up in the hospital with my friend watching over me. I mean, it wasn't a prophetic pro prophetic How do you how do you pronounce that? Like prophet Take moment or anything like that. But ever since then, I felt like it was my calling. But I wanted to help people the same way they helped me. Huh. It's interesting, though. One would think being attacked by a white knight would make the fear in the opposite direction. Yeah, but it was another one that saved me. So I kind of guide myself towards judging everything on an individual basis. Well, not to be an extremist extent, but you get it. You get me. Yeah, I try to do the same too. I joined the Valkyrie Corps specifically, though. I wanted to rescue people from dire situations were never possible. She's a Segi no Mikata, a hero of justice. Going into patrols and all that felt too tiresome. It's also the same with the least paperwork involved. The one with the least paperwork involved. <laughs> now that I think about it, there are a different types of white knights, huh? I guess white knight is too broad a term. It's not one specific type. There are too many different classes. Rescue a soul. There's even a squad full of bureaucrats. I've never said that. I've never heard anyone say that word. Did I say it right? I assume I did. Really? Yeah, they gotta send it to companies to handle the accounting and that kind of stuff. People will usually ask for them because they speed up processes. But if you were assigned to when a company is suspected of having weird, under the table deals. Interesting. There's also a squad dedicated to fighting school bullying. They were doing a nice job, but the fad of anti bullying campaigns passed and they lost their funding. I believe some members still work with anti bullying cases in an unofficial capacity. That'd be nice, I think. Can I get you anything else? I don't know if I should. Can't afford that many drinks. Besides, I don't even know that much about alcohol can handle. Yeah, you can see that. Oh, you know what? I'll have something else. Remember some drink called a martini? Grantini. No, I'm pretty sure it's martini. Grantini, trust me, I'll get you one. What? Is that like that's the brand, the brandini? Yeah, the reason the dystopian future exists is because of no more martinis. I gotta be honest, I'm not really for sure what a martini is. All aged and mixed. Who wants a martini? No, sorry. Right, is Martini like a brand? Like, then that's why they can't, like, you know, serve one? Or is that just for the dystopian future show? I don't know anything about alcohol. Here, see? Oh, you're right. Thanks. You know what? I think I'll bring a friend of mine here in a couple of days. Really? Why? I like the feel of this place. I'll share it. You know, the, the, yeah, you ought to share the smell of dog urine. Might be a bit different. Though. More in time. Classier. Not that this place isn't nice, but you know, you know, don't worry. You know this kind of place I work in. I know the kind of place I work in. I see. But it shouldn't be too bad. I just need to. What was that? Sounded like an explosion. I better check that out. Paid you already, right? Yep, go ahead. Be careful. I will. She left her helmet. Well, she's coming back. I'll just hold it, hold it for her. I'll go check what the ever-loving HECK that explosion was. Careful. What? Oh, she woke up. Oh yeah, that one girl with the boss girl. Where am I? Where am I? Uh, good evening and welcome to Valhalla. You're dead. That might not have been the best thing to say. Well, Valhalla. Am I dead? <laughs> Does that mean 
that Uncle Ingus is rambling. He's about to act like looking like a shoddy downtown bar. True? Yeah. Called it. Uh, after that? Not dead? Uh, as far as I can tell, no. To be fair, don't know how death the after that works exactly. But you're breathing, right? Alright. And where the heck <laughs> am I? How did I get here? You brought me here. What are you planning to do with me? Serve you alcohol. And you organ traffickers, you robbers, rapists, pickpockets. Your pickpockets, right? Oh, of course. We picked the, a giant pocket, and you're, you're the one we brought out. You see? Why aren't you saying anything? Uh, waiting for you to bite your wings. Otherwise, you'll just. You're rapists, aren't you? Rapists! The whole lot of you! But, but I'm going to I'm gonna tear my clothes, beat me unconscious, have your horrible way with me, then brutally murder you. Don't you? I'm all still violating. Lood! Lood! I'm not repeating that! I'm, I'm also not going to say murder like 20 times. Interrupt me. Oh, this is going nowhere. Right? Let's see if I can get a drink to calm me down. With your other face. Be careful, Joe. Give, give me something that will calm her down. Zen Star. for fans of the movie or you did. Use the That's probably a reference I don't get. Velvety. More of them will be sleeping down. Fuck you. This might work. Abu Delta. Optional counter chain. I just get a drunk. I can't go around. I drink. We're in a bar. Where's your drinks? Uh, a bar? So I figured I should give you something to help you calm down. Don't worry, it's on the house. Calm down? What do you spice it with? Goofies? KTX? Pumpkins? <laughs> I like to imagine someone just putting like an entire pumpkin into like this small drink. God, no. I wouldn't even think of it. Stuttering makes me suspicious, you know? I never gotta let anything like that to your drink. They dock my pay and tips. Not to mention, I'd have to pay any lawsuits myself. That's the best case scenario. Who get fired and lose benefits or go to jail? And trust me, the BTC loves to catch anyone who commits that particular felony. They, they show themselves all proud for a hefty PR boost. The thought of going through all that is just... Bleh. What's that sound effect supposed to be? Like, shudder? Even if you say that, let's do something. Go outside, and just three businesses to walk, you'll find a convenience store. I sell drug tests for drinks. Tell the cashier that Dana Zane sent you. Dana Zane, I guess? <laughs> Two flying cars crashed in one pool. That's why it's so noisy. Any damage? Hole in the street. Don't know about drivers or anything. I see. Either way, I think I'm done here. Did you check inside the toilet papers locker? What about- OH MY GOD! How? What? How? I'm back. Try to give me bandages up here still. Do you have to pay? No. No problem then. Try it on the drink. It says negative. There you go. You could be in cahoots with the clerk in the story. Even knew your name. Good point. First of all, it's not my name. It's my boss's. Second, pretty much part of a chain. Sort of like the spicy chicken of bars. Finally, not making you drink this. I offered it to you as a sign of peace. I mean, you are right. It is indeed suspicion in my part. Sorry. You can just ignore the dream. Go through that door and forget this ever happened. 
That'd be it. You're at peace and nothing of value would be lost. Reverse psychology. We got it. <laughs> Jumps out here. <laughs> Are you implying something won't have value because I made it? Are you saying my presence is so unimportant that my lack of action will yield no difference? Eh? Wait, 20 minutes in? What? What about the dream? Are you gonna let this pewter you work go to waste so easily? No, I... Oh, I'll let you know. I'm not that un unimportant. That work doesn't... That your work does matter. I'm not sure you should drink it at all so, all so fast. So how was it? Hmm. It's fine. Not something I'm ordered or anything. Are you alright? Yeah. Guess you were telling the truth. Sorry about that. No problem. Where were you? And I've probably reacted the same way. I should apologize for my last comment too. Came out as insensitive. Guess I'll stay a while. We got her! Hook line sinker! Did you get my thoughts in order? Can you tell me how I got here? My boss found you unconscious and brought you here for safekeeping. And you were asleep until that car crash outside. I see. I guess it's better to wake up here than on the streets. Stripped of clothes, dignity, and or organs. Oh yeah, by the way, you're missing a few organs. How did he fall unconscious? Are you tired? Sick? Yes, I'm sick. you would rather not talk about it. Of course. I'll tell you what. Your drinks are in the house tonight. But don't do this. Why would he do that? Considering an apology on behalf of everyone, you're all the trouble we've caused you. No, look, your money is... You have grant. Also, something tells me you might need another drink right now. Yeah, might be right. Okay then, take you on here. Piano man! Will you be fine? Yeah, just go for the last one, so I want to enjoy this one. Coming right up then. Just me for a piano man. Don't see a woman asking for a piano man every day. There's a piano woman too, right? Yeah, what's the difference? So they're usually called piano woman, but too many people complain there should be a piano woman if there's a piano man. What? This drink does not represent the opinions of the Bar Pianist Union or its associates. The promo drink. Did I get that right? Two, three, five, five. Okay. Uh, okay, mix. There we go. Here. Yeah, this is the one. Matt used to drink these before an actual pianist attempted to kill him. What, what, what did he do? Your dad, I mean. I mean, to provoke a pianist like that. Wrong place at the wrong time, I guess. He was relaxing in a bar, and suddenly the pianist left off the stage and started punching him. Some say he was off his meds, and that my dad. My dad looked like some music critic that had bashed him. So hold my stance that he just got too excited. Jazz does that to you. Okay, I, I see. The Piano Man has an interesting story. It was originally created by a bartender in honor of a pianist friend of his that had just died. Apparently, mixes all the flavors said friend liked the most. Oh, that's nice. So this is how it feels to go for a drink at the end of a long card day on work. Not sure if I like the fact that I'm following you now. Where do you work? Uh, miss... Call me Kim. It's not my name, but you can call me Kim. I don't know if it's a work yet, though. Still just an intern. Can I ask where? Have you heard of a newspaper called the Augman? Is that where the guy for it was from earlier? Uh, early every morning. In fact, Donovan D. Dawson was here earlier. I knew I spelled his nasty for me. That not so swell dude leaves his roof wherever he goes. So, you believe me? I do. Yeah, you have no idea how much I hate that ch chauvinistic. Wow, that's just mean. You can't call people that. That bubble blower. Everybody blows bubbles. <laughs> that's what jail sounds like. Harsh words. The worst part is that I kind of admire the way he does stuff. So forceful about the things he wants to, that people have done it before they realize what's going on. You even got a pizza delivery boy to work server maintenance. Full week passed before the pizza shop asked where the heck he was. What do you believe in? The guy came back decent at server maintenance, despite having no previous previous experience. It's kind of admirable, but at the same time, hate his guts. 
Ah. Knowing that I have to work here. Ah. Uh, why are you working here then? Did I ask something I should have? No, no, don't forget about it. I'd rather not talk about it though. Fair enough. What's your name, bartender? Call me Jill. Is it hard to be a bartender, Jill? I guess it's hard as being a cook somewhere. Keep going through the motions while trying to provide something of quality. All while answering the whimsy of people's orders. I think the hardest part is dealing with the chemical hazards some people might leave behind. Why? At one point I thought about being a bartender. But I was afraid they'd make me wear skimpy clothes and dance or something. Here we go again. Well, depends on where you start working, you know? I guess I was lucky Valhalla didn't end up being a tacky disco or seen by a DJ with an Android. My boss just wanted a comfy place, I think. Your boss sounds like an interesting person. Well, with wanting to put me somewhere safe and all that. She is! She's so cool and collected. And she's listening, isn't she? <laughs> has no qualms about showing excitement about stuff. Sure, she's been a bit tense the last couple of days. But even then, when you're with her, everything just feels under control. She also has this mechanical arm. No idea how she got it, but... <laughs> Sorry, I got carried away. It's fun to see you break the wise bartender character you reason to you. I do that? It'd be nice to meet this boss of you sometime, I thank you. Fellow caller, should be glad to know you're okay. Oh, no, I couldn't pass through that way. Besides, give me away. I don't want to abuse your generosity. And that's for another one, although I don't know how much alcohol you can handle. Maybe I can handle another drink. One Brantini, please. Coming right home. Right, so when, when bartenders say it's on me, they don't actually pay out of pocket, they just kind of serve it. Brantini. Sorry, a mar- Ah, a Brantini, yes, that. Uh, and aged and mixed. Here. Yep, this seems like this one. Cheers! Ahem. <coughs> Ahem. Uh, are you alright? Yeah, just a bit. Ahem. Dizzy. And you're clearing your throat? It <coughs> helps me focus a bit. Yeah, I'm ready now. Hey, Jill, you work with other women? I work for a woman, but my only co-worker is male. Why? You lucky... Uh, girl, you. I mean... No idea that I have any of it. I started my internship. Every intern was female. Have you ever tried competing with a woman for a good spot? They're relentless. Have you tried making friends with any of them? Friends? Wow, you, look, those uh, ill spirited but good meaning women who I respect aren't in it for friendship. They're out for blood. Uh, sorry, I mean. The other day, I got an assignment. All I got for my efforts was an afternoon spent locked in the bathroom. What? This other time? When a supervisor faced me? Still looking for my briefcase. <sighs> Sometimes I just want to take all those, uh, women who I respect, but respect slightly less than I respect other women because I respect women, and throw them in the sewers or something. <laughs> I really like that joke. You can probably tell. Let the lizardmen feast on their liveries. I'm just so tired of having to deal with that. Tired of having to put up with them. Tired. Tired. No, no sleeping here, please. You want me to call you a cab? Would you be so kind? Hey, it's Jill. Can you send us a cab? Client? Just a second. Hey, Kim. Gonna need your full name. Kimberly Lovellette. Oh, what a flowery name. Kimberly Lovellette. No, no idea how to spell that. No, she's too sleepy to answer that. Okay, fine. Thanks a lot. We'll be here in a minute. She went through a lot today again. Hey, Jill. Bathroom's done. I'm leaving. Guide Miss Lovette the light to her cab on the way out, please. Oh, she woke up and fell asleep again. Sure, I need to be client. Excuse me, Miss. Please help me walk you, walk you to your cab. Big buckets. And that's it. Are we done for the night? Seems like it. Where's Gil? And where's the girl that was here? Gil cleaned the bathroom and left because he stank. Kim woke up, had a couple of drinks, and left. So she's called Kim. How does she look to you? How was she? She freaked out when she woke up, but she managed to calm down. Are you worried about her? Wouldn't you be? 
I don't know. Hey boss, do you like calling your bosses too impersonal? Hmm? Not really, no. It's not like you call me that because I'm a stranger, just out of habit. Oh. Anyway, you're free to go after you finish washing up the glass teeth. Let me transfer you today's paper. Maybe we'll give Gil a small bonus for dealing with the past year. Total earnings, 2,730. Earnings total, 1,180. Mistakes, zero. Commission, 30%. Today's payment, 654. Tips, 550. Flawless service bonus, 500. Use an extra for helping the Daryl Compound, 500. Oh, it worked! Today's total transfer, 2,204. Okay. Your membership to Shining Fingers will automatically renew on the 17th. Make sure your account has at least 800 by then. Jill is lost in thought about a hollow plan. Buying it will prevent her from getting too distracted. To browse Danger slash you, you can visit JC Elton's. Okay, uh, how far are we in? 30 minutes? Yep, that's good to call it. Uh, what's the shop? I want to see this first. So we can just buy things? Yeah. Are they... There's that one thing she said. Uh, hollow plant? Memory of a real potted plant? We, we should probably buy that then. I assume it's in the room now. She's pleased with herself. She'll surely focus at work. Is that the plan? I, I didn't look at it in before, you know, so. Okay, guys. Uh, wait, wait. Settings? No, no, no. Yeah, the phone. The phone. This phone is really cool, by the way. Uh, life backup 1.1. Save. Day 2. Rig. Yeah, so it's been, uh, um, exactly, almost exactly a week. I was off right now. Okay, guys, so I'll see you guys next time with Valhalla. Uh, probably be like two, three days, because I'll record Versailles and then this again. So, I'll see you guys then. Bye!